his legs despite the long flight. Uh, I tell you, Team Canada had to be prepared to withstand the first five minutes of the checks because they were flying. 1910 shots on goal. All Canada, just one goal on the board, and it was world class. It was world class, and when you score goals, uh, you have to use many parts of your body. How about using your hand, Jake Muzzin, hand, as he puts the puck down. Then, Sidney Crosby. You can never give a great player a bad pass. That's what Lemieux told me. And Crosby took it with a skate, found Everly. Hall, you know he was yelling, using his voice. And Everly using his eyes. So hands, feet, eyes, voice. You have to score goals. That was transition, 200 feet of uh, great hockey. It was great hockey. Seventh goal for Taylor Hall. He's with Brian Mudrick. Taylor, they come up with a ton of firepower. How big was Mike Smith for you guys early in that period? Yeah, he made some big saves, let us calm down a bit. Um, you know, it's a rocking building, and, you know, for us to not uh, allow any goals or, or take any penalties in the first period is a great uh, is a great thing. The shot you took off the bar, did you think that went in initially? Yeah, yeah, I was, uh, I had my hands up before it went in the air, so uh, that serves me right for uh, for not going in, but um, we got to get some more shots on this guy make sure we're challenging him. On the actual goal, just talk about Sid, that pass like world class, and then it was a tap in from Ebbs there. Yeah, it's two world-class plays um, by Sid and Ebbs. Uh, you know, I thought we had a really good period. We we're in there in the whole time, and we got to keep that going. It's uh, it's going to be a, a game that's fought till the end. Finally, what's the atmosphere like out there? It's great. Um, you know, even though they're not cheering for for Canada, it's a lot of fun to play in an atmosphere like this, and you can really feel that uh, you know they care for their country, so it's fun. Thanks for your time. Thank you.